Whenever there is a new Descendants movie out, the social media goes crazy over it. And rightfully so. Now it is time to go crazy once again as Descendants 5 is on its way. And it will be totally amazing. As you all know, the Descendants franchise has always been about transformation, and that continued with the rise of Red. One of the most noticeable changes was the almost complete absence of the original main cast. The film introduced brand new characters like Red, the daughter of the Queen of Hearts, and Chloe, Cinderella's daughter, setting the story in a fresh, new direction while still retaining the essence of the original Descendants films. A lot of us were initially skeptical given that major characters like Mal and Evie were not returning. But the movie's success showed that this new direction could work, and we were quick to embrace the new characters and storyline. What helped The Rise of Red stand out was its fresh take on the Descendants universe. It brought in a time travel plot, where Red and Chloe team up to stop the Queen of Hearts from becoming the villain she's destined to be. By traveling back in time to Oradon's past, they try to change the course of history. The film didn't just rely on nostalgia for the older films, but created a compelling new narrative that felt both fresh and familiar. This blending of the new with the old is what's helping the Descendants franchise stay relevant, even after nine years. To absolutely no one's surprise, reactions to The Rise of Red were overwhelmingly positive. Most of us praised the film for keeping the heart of the original franchise intact while exploring new territory. The time travel aspect, combined with the emotional depth of Red and Chloe's journey, struck a chord with both longtime viewers and newcomers to the series. The film's success has also been attributed to its darker tone, tackling themes like destiny, familial expectations, and the consequences of altering time. One standout element of The Rise of Red was its ending, which left us on a cliffhanger. As Red and Chloe celebrate their success in changing the Queen of Hearts fate, Uma's voiceover hints at the fallout from their time-traveling antics with the following words, Everybody got what they wanted, but getting what you want can be dangerous, especially when you mess with the fabric of time. You didn't think that was the end of this story, did you? This cryptic line had us buzzing, speculating on what could come next in Descendants 5. It's clear that the fifth installment will dive deeper into the consequences of Red and Chloe's actions. Messing with time always has repercussions, and we are eager to see how this will unfold. Will they have to fix the mistakes they made, or will the damage already be too great? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. The good news is, we won't have to wait so long to get the answers. Descendants 5 is already in development, and while there hasn't been an official release date, we are hopeful for a 2027 premiere, based on the production timeline of The Rise of Red. The fifth movie is expected to continue Red and Chloe's journey, likely dealing with the fallout of their time-traveling adventure and exploring how their actions have reshaped the future of Aradon. Plus, the cast of Descendants 4, particularly Kylie Cantrell and Malia Baker, have expressed excitement about returning for Descendants 5. In interviews, Cantrell and Baker have said they're eager to dive back into their roles and continue the story. We can also expect China and McLean to return as Uma, the fan-favorite character who has been a key figure since Descendants 2. McLean's involvement in The Rise of Red has only increased speculation about how her character will evolve in the upcoming film. However, it's unclear if any of the original cast members like Dove Cameron or Sophia Carson will make appearances in Descendants 5. Cameron, who portrayed Mal in the first three films, has expressed in interviews that she doesn't see herself returning to the franchise without the full original cast, particularly after the tragic passing of Cameron Boyce, who played Carlos. In one interview, she shared, I'm gonna say no, because I don't think it would be the same without the whole original cast. It would just be different now, and also we did it. We told a full story. We completed it. That said, some of us are still holding out hope for a possible cameo from Cameron or other members of the original cast. It would be a bittersweet moment that could add even more depth to Descendants 5, especially as the new cast forges their own legacy within the franchise. One thing is for sure, Descendants 5 has a lot to live up to. With the massive success of The Rise of Red and the continuing love for the franchise, expectations are high. I am eager to see how Disney will continue to innovate within the Descendants universe while staying true to the core themes that made the series a global phenomenon. What are you guys most excited about the upcoming movie? Can't wait to hear your thoughts about it. For more content on The Descendants and other Disney movies, make sure to like and follow. Meanwhile, the video on the screen might also interest you.